Okay, good evening. So today we're going to see the topic about five digit handling. So under that we are going to see about that uh, what are the files and how to retrieve the data from the file and then access and handling and uh, some of the things you can see in the first one is an uh, origin back files. So normally we have files is a collection of data or information, something else. So uh, basically we are using a files, right? Using a file in our offices. So what is the use of that file? Uh, it's now some um, consists of some papers. The paper having the called record. Uh, it contains the record. And we store into the, the record into the file. And also most of the most of the offices they are using as a confidential. Uh, likewise, uh, it is a collection of some records uh, or some information or data that is called as some files. Here, uh, definition of file means the collection of data or information right into the notepad. Uh, so basically, we write the data into the notepad and save the information. Save it as uh, this called as a file. So all the information stored in a computer must be in a file. Uh, so in our computer, we are having a folder. Uh, so inside the folder, we have some text file or any document. Uh, these are the called as the files. The file is named location on a disk to store related information. File is a named location on disk to store related information. Uh, so basically, we uh, have a file uh, name for the file. For example, we have uh, some information in the file and it is stored into the uh, own name that is called as a name and location to store the related information. But also, it is used to permanently store data in non volatile memory, example, hard disk. Uh, so, now the uh, files are stored in our computer uh, where the data should be stored, it is in the hard disk. Uh, since uh, random access is a memory is a volatile, which lasts the data and computer is turned off. Uh, suppose if we're using uh, you store the data into the RAM, which uh, should be losses when the system is uh, turned off. Then we use file for future use of data. So basically, we why we using the why we store the file in our computer for the further use. So whenever we need the file, we just open the and read the information or or, or write the information in the file. And finally, how to store the save the file. That is a definition about the files. So we are having a different types of files, as known data files, text files, program files, and directory files. Uh, so these are the different data, different types of files uh, to store the information. So in the data files, we use to store the data or information. Next one, text file, using uh, to store the text, either it is a document or a txt, something like that. Next one, program files, and then store the programs into the file, next one directories. So for normally we're using these directory files to store the uh, files as directory. So these are the different types of files. Next one, types of file accessing. Types of file accessing. Uh, in these uh, types we are having sequential access and random access. So what is in the sequential access? Uh, so that means uh, in our file, we have a lot of in, uh, information into the file. So we want to access the last record in a file. We, we want to use in the sequential file. It takes more time to access in the record. Uh, that means here we want to access the last record in a file. We must read all the records sequentially. Uh, that is in sequential access. Uh, that means uh, if we want to uh, read the last record, that means last information of the file, you must go through the from starting itself. So at the time, we uh, take more time to access the record. Next one, random access. Uh, this type of file is allows to access a specific data directly without assigning specific data items. That means uh, wherever we want the data, we just directly go to the data and read it. That is a random access. Randomly, we can access and modify the data. Next one is the file operations. Uh, we have some file operations. Uh, 
uh, you want to read out right into the file we just want to read or write first we want to open file open the file after uh, read or write process then it needs to close then only we avoid the data losses uh, what is the first process first process is first we have to open the file this one read or write the data uh, into the file but after uh, read or write we have to close the file these are the operations first one file open so how to open the file uh if you want to open the file uh, in the python having the built in function called open of method so in this open of method you to open the file this function returns a file object so it is most commonly used with two arguments so what are the arguments uh, that means the access mode and buffering access mode means that means uh, either it is open with a read mode or write mode and then buffered Buffering means either either is a zero or one. So the syntax of file to open function function is first you have to give the file object that is name of the file, name of the uh, function and then equal to open of method inside that we will just give the file name and then access mode and buffering. So the access mode is and uh, to determine the mode in the file has to be open. So we are having. Uh, different modes access modes that's so one is a read or write or read and write so open like this so you just give the or it opens only the read mode next one is in buffering 0 comma 1 if 0 there is no buffering if one line buffering is performed while accessing the file these are the buffering next one file object once a file is open we have to have one more one file object so that means If you want to open the file, definitely have to give the file object. Which file you have to open? The uh, example of this uh, file open is we have equal to open up student dot txt and w. So the already we discussed about the open up method. This method is used to open the file. Which file you have to you have to open student dot txt file in which mode? That means write mode. So here we have to write the information or content into the store under PHP. There is the use of this write mode. This one uh, with and as statement. We are using a with and as statement. The user can also work with the file of the using the with statement. It is designed to provide much cleaner syntax and extra handling for working with code. Uh, that means. Uh, with open or as open as file name that is a with the as statement. Uh, that means uh, the syntax for this with statement is with open or file name access mode as file. So we want to open this file and with open mode with open of stamp dot txt write mode as file file dot write of file. So have to open the file stamp dot txt and we have to write the content in file. file in the file sample txt so so after open that sample txt you have to see the content file in this sample txt that is the use of with and as statement so some of the file opening methods that is more of file first one or that is an open the file for reading so um, when you see now this hard uh, mode that is read mode the file pointer is placed at the beginning of the file to start thing to read the content from the beginning of the uh, file it's on write mode open the file for writing only to overwrite the file already exist the file does not exist create a new file for writing that's one rb that is in read and read only in binary format that will be in write only in binary files it's on r plus Uh, while we using of R plus, it opens a file for reading and writing purpose. So both reading and writing is to be done in the R plus mode and then W plus. So this is also same as open a file for reading and writing. We have to overwrite the file by using a W plus. Action A is a file for appending. This file pointer is at the end of the line. So while using of append mode, 
the file pointer in, in the uh, file uh, point out in the last of the information that means last of the line it's from ab it is an upper in binary format next one how to read and write in the files uh, with the help of read and write mode uh, these are the uh, file object uses to access the file for reading and writing next one uh, write mode this method writes any string to an open text file uh, while using our write mode so we have uh, write any content into the particular file the write mode does not add a new line to the character to the end of the string the syntax of the write mode file object or write of string we uh, just give the string within the double quotes uh, directly write into the particular file the example for the write mode we have to to open on sample.txt write plus that is an both read and write mode let the write of problem solving python programming this is the content we have to write into the sample.txt so after write that uh, we read the content what is the content uh, into the sample.txt after that that dot post so if you if you open that file definitely we have to close the file at the end of the program so what is the content uh, you write into the sample.txt problem solving python programming so using of read of method to read the content in yep yep so you get the output of problem solving python programming next we we'll read the text file using a read method and this method reads a string from the open text file uh, the read method starting reading from the beginning of the file so in using of the read of method uh, the file pointer start to read the content from the beginning of the file next one, the parameter is a number of bytes to be read from the open file the syntax for read of method file of the dot read of count this is syntax uh, using of read line whenever the user run the method it return a string of character that contains single line of information from the file that means uh, if you want to open the kk.txt and the read mode so already so the kk.txt has some content or information in information that the information that to be with the using of read line of method print file name file dot read line of so already Uh, the content hello world in the ticket uh, in the text file this content we read it the way by using of this or mode that means read mode so we go for our understand about the file handling so we will discuss the other topics we will talk about thank you